this time this is chapter 12 light and all the solution is here fill in the blanks an image which can be obtained on a screen is called a real image the angle of reflection is equal to the angle of incidence yes. the incident ray the normal at the point of incidence and the reflected ray, ray all lie in the same plane the point where a concave mirror forms the image of a very distant object is known as the focus of the mirror a spherical mirror that always forms a virtual erect and diminished image of an object is a convex mirror eye specialists use ophthalmoscope which is fitted with concave mirror next is true and false now the image formed by a plane mirror shows the right side of the object at its right side and the left side object of the object as its left side this is false statement when a sta we stand between a pair of light parallel plane mirrors we can see an infinite number of images this is true statement a concave mirror can never be formed a virtual image of an object this is false statement we can use either a concave mirror or a convex mirror as the reflected in the torches this is false statement motor vehicles generally use either a plane mirror or a convex mirror as their rear view mirror this is false statement let's do the mcq tick the correct option the angle of incidence equals the angle between the incident ray and the reflected ray. Uh, second, a ray of light falling normally on a plane mirror gets reflected in such a way that it just retraces the path. Question number three, the central point of the section of the sphere used for making a spherical mirror is known as the center of curvature of the mirror. The distance between the object and its image in a plane mirror is six meter. If the object moves one meter towards the mirror, then the new distance between the object and its image will be 4 meter. The rear view uh, mirror of a car is a plane mirror. A driver is reversing his car at the speed of 4 meter per second. The driver sees in his rear view mirror the image of a scooter parked behind his car. The speed at which its image appears to approach the driver will be just double 8 meter per second. Now let's move to the question answer. Uh, explain clearly the difference between a real image and a virtual image. Give one example of a virtual image. So whenever there is difference between type of question, uh, go for the tabular form. This is real image, virtual image. Real images are formed on the screen. Virtual image appear to get on the lens of the mirror itself or the behind the mirror. Image formed is actual. Image formed is imaginary. Real images are inverted virtual images are erect real images are formed on the screen okay this is twice it is twice so this is twice let's remove this so this has been done and fourth it always form in front of the mirror and it always form behind the mirror and example for virtual images the image you see in the mirror image you see in the mirror now let's move how does changing the distance of object from a convex mirror affect the size and nature of the image formed by it if you move the object towards a convex mirror the size of the images will image will increase when we move the object away from the mirror the size will decrease Nature of image will remain the same in both the cases. Now draw a ray diagram to show the formation of image when the object is placed between C center of curvature and F focus. So this is direct taken from the book. This is the image formed. It is beyond the center of curvature. The image, the nature of image is inverted and it is enlarged. 
वेर वुड यू कीप एन ऑब्जेक्ट इन फ्रंट ऑफ अकाउंट के मिरर टू गेट अ वर्चुअल एंड मैग्नीफाइड इमेज ऑफ इट इन ऑर्डर टू ऑप्टेन अ वर्चुअल एंड मैग्नीफाइड इमेज ऑफ द ऑब्जेक्ट वी शुड कीप एन ऑब्जेक्ट इन फ्रंट ऑफ द अकाउंट के मिरर बिटवीन फोकस एंड पोल ऑफ द कॉन्केव मिरर दिस इज पोल एंड दिस इज फोकस एंड वेन इट इज पुट हियर द ऑब्जेक्ट इज पुट बिटवीन फोकस एंड पोल दिस इज पोल दिस इज पोल सो द इमेज फॉर्म इज मैग्नीफाइड द मैग्नीफाइड इमेज ऑफ एन ऑब्जेक्ट अपियर्स टू फॉर्म बिहाइंड द मिरर ऑफ एन apparent intersection of the reflected ray what can you say about the nature of the image the type of mirror used the magnified image of an object appears to be formed behind the mirror by an apparent intersection of the reflected ray then the nature of the image is virtual and the type of mirror is concave question number 6 rohit suggested to his father to fix a security mirror which would provide them with a wider view of the surrounding of their shop name the type of mirror that rohit must have suggested to his father also mention the basic characteristic of the image formed by this type of mirror type of mirror his father should use is convex mirror characteristic of the image formed by this mirror are as follows image is formed behind the mirror in a convex mirror case the size of the image increases when we move the object towards the mirror the image formed by a convex mirror is virtual erect and diminished in nature the size of the image will decrease when we move objects far away from the convex mirror question number 7 state the type of mirror that the following items objects would correspond to a inside of a stain, stainless steel ball reflector of a torch a polished shining wooden surface the shiny outer surface of the bicycle bell bell answer 7 the type of mirror corresponding to the inside of the stainless comes under the concave mirror the reflector of torch comes under concave mirror a polished shining wooden surface will be a plane mirror uh, the shiny outer surface of the bicycle bell that is convex mirror now let's do the question number 1 the e uh, e part state the laws of reflection describe an activity to show the incident ray reflected ray and the normal at the point of incidence all lie in the same plane now laws of reflection state the incident ray the normal at the point of incident and reflected ray all lie in the same plane and the second law is the angle of incidence and the angle of reflection are equal you can write like this angle of incident r uh, is always equal to angle of reflection so uh, this activity the incident ray reflected ray and the normal at the point of incident all lie in the same plane now adjust a plane mirror on a plane white surface take a laser torch torch light the torch in such a way that it its ray is on the paper plane draw a normal on the white sheet at the point of incident now what you will observe the incident uh, light reflects and the reflected ray is formed on the same sheet of the paper on which the incident ray was formed at the normal this shows that all these lie on the same plane this is the diagram for to incorporated with now second trace the path of reflected ray in the following ray diagram so this is the way it will reflect this is normal this is normal the ray of reflection is this this is normal and this is normal this is reflected ray reflected ray reflected ray third draw a ray diagram to show the formation of the image of a point object by a plane mirror a convex mirror plane mirror this is given in page number 180 this is incident ray this is reflected ray and this is apparent intersection convex mirror 
this is convex mirror and image formed is here this is object and image formed is here that means this is virtual diminished and erect now question number five the three person are standing at a point pqr in front of the plane mirror can p see himself in the mirror also can he see the image of q and r in the mirror p obviously cannot because the mirror is not this long so it cannot so let's illustrate how whether the p will be able to see the image of q or r so this is the field view of the observer this p pq will uh, this p person will see the image which will be formed on this region which will be formed on this region in this region you, you see that q is not forming on this region but r so he will be able to see the image of r but not q fifth with the help of suitable diagram explain the meaning of the following terms for concave mirror center of curvature pole principal axis focus so this is a simple diagram to show different elements the center of curvature is the center of a sphere where part is is the spherical mirror is this is this is center of curvature and this is the part of the whole surface sphere pole of the mirror is the central point lying on the spherical mirror this is the center point of the spherical mirror principal axis is an imaginary line that joins the pole of the mirror and the center of curvature this is principal axis this is joining pole and center of curvature focus is the is such a point that all line play, uh, line parallel to the principal axis will meet or appear to meet at this point this is focus all incident rays passing parallel to the principal axis will be passing through the focus now what type of mirror is used in the following case is the image form virtual and erect in each case now see makeup mirror plane mirror or a uh, concave can be used but uh, here it is mirror is plane mirror virtual and erect rear view mirror of vac uh, vehicles convex mirror the nature of image is virtual erect and diminish reflecting type telescope concave mirror virtual inverted and magnified shaving mirror concave mirror is used virtual and erect image is formed value based question it was celebration time for manuel as their son had become a full fledged and registered dentist the father uh, father advised his son to always maintain the same level of empathy sincerity and dedication towards all his patient irrespective of their financial or social status yes brother said his younger sister you must behave like the spherical mirror that you would often use it reflects light to anyone whoever whosoever is being examined uh, uh, list at least two other values you may like to add to suggestion given by the senior mr menon so uh, uh, values can be moral integrity and honesty which is essential for uh, medicine medical profession now answer 2 name the type of spherical mirror used by dentist and draw the appropriate ray diagram to support your answer so this is the since dentist has to get the magnified image so it uses concave mirror this is the diagram that's all thank you hope it will help